Good morning on this Monday. It might be a little tough for you this morning to wake up. Of course, we sprung forward this weekend, meaning we lost an hour of sleep Saturday night and into Sunday. So it feels a little bit earlier uh, than it is out there. So kind of a tough start. We do have some OK weather for your commute to work this morning, though. So that's the good thing as we're looking ahead in the forecast today. We're going to see that uh, quieter weather here, but it is a little chillier. Something to be aware of. Low clouds right now as well. So looking a little bit more on the mostly cloudy side to start off our day. Let's take a look at our conditions. We are a little chilly again. We've got temperatures in the single digits up north. We're at six, our low lowest temperature right now in Thief River Falls. There are a lot of sevens on the map too up north. Uh, Grand Forks, one of those spots. And Fargo's at 15 degrees, a little milder to the south and east. Right now, Park Rapids is at 22, and so is the Sisseton area. But factoring in that wind, it's a little breezy out there. So it feels like we're below zero in a lot of spots. So today, I know we, we were thinking spring this weekend, but it's going to feel more like winter here today. So you're going to want to make sure you're dressed for that. 12 below in Hallock, 9 below in Grand Forks, and 2 below currently your wind chill in Fargo. Here's that wind. It's out of the north. Most places seeing steady speeds in the teens. There have been some gusts still in the 20s and 30s. Right now our peak gust is 26 miles per hour out of the north at the moment. And we'll see that kind of dwindle a little bit more as we progress through the day. So that'll be nice to get that wind a little quieter. The light snow that we have, we had a couple of isolated snow showers overnight. That's moved on. We're just generally looking at some partly cloudy to mostly cloudy skies to start off. So here's a look at that hour by hour planner. Today, pretty quiet once we get that wind to ease up. But on top of that, though, we do have that cooler air that takes over here with that northerly wind. And so as we head into the nine o'clock hour, seeing those temperatures pretty close to zero for some of us along the international border. We do start to see those numbers rise this morning as we head into the noon hour. We'll see temperatures back into the teens and some sunshine mixed in with a couple of clouds. You can see some here more likely over to the east this morning and then into the afternoon hours. We're warming back up into some teens and some 20s. So we'll see temperatures about half that what we saw on Saturday in some spots. So we really are going to notice a difference here today. At least it's quiet. At least We'll have some sunshine in there uh, and uh, an easier uh, way to ease into the week here this week. Heading into this evening, heading home from work, pretty quiet. We're looking at temperatures back down into the teens, even some single digits here into the late night hours. And as we start off the day tomorrow, similar numbers. But the key thing here is we see that wind switch to a southerly direction, and that will change things up for us and start to introduce some warmer air for the valley. Speaking of warming, we've been seeing some melting lately. I'm sure you've noticed it with the milder weather. This is along the Red River. Uh, wintry scene still, still lots of snow by the river, but there's some uh, melting going on on the edges there. Thanks, Glenn, for sharing that. And here's your seven day planner. Expect to see those temperatures today being the coldest of the week, kind of bookending it with a little bit cooler temperatures here. So on Monday today, we're going to see some teens and some low 20s heading into Tuesday. A slight chance for some light snow showers, but not a great shot. Just keep that in mind. Otherwise, it's pretty quiet all week. We're looking at some numbers by Wednesday back above freezing so warming things up little by little and in fact by Thursday we're back into the low 40s coming up here for today with temperatures that will be uh, hanging on there into the 30s by Friday expect to see some temperatures into the around that 30 degree range for Saturday and Sunday and a chance for a little snow this weekend okay but we're heading in the direct right direction that's right thank you Lisa it does